piece of wood has character, has a life. And I think sometimes what I'm able to do and what I try to do is to simply bring that out of the piece of wood. It's already there. Sculptors sometimes talk about simply removing everything that isn't the sculpture that they want to make and then what's left is their sculpture. I think that's a little bit true about how I connect with my work too. I'm Daryl Nickel. I'm a woodworker and furniture maker in Golden, Colorado. This is my workshop space and it's a historic old building that's a great place to work. So that's where we are. Uh, the chair that was chosen for the show at Fo Foothills Art Center uh, is a Windsor chair. It's made out of walnut. Uh, Windsor chairs are a favorite of mine to make because they're as handmade a piece of furniture, literally handmade, as anything that I do. When the shavings are coming off the wood, it's like I'm stepping back in history. And, I, and I'm, you know, I'm 200 years ago, you know, or whatever, 100 years ago. And I'm also thinking about what the wood looks like with a really nice, clean cut, and what it's showing me about its grain and about its character. Creativity is sort of in the background most of the time, and then I'll crank up the music. You heard the only song that's left unsung, and it sounded just like echoes in a canyon. Voices from a distant hideaway. Silent sounds of paths gone down old trailheads, curves gone round. Slow to fade, but never really gone. Follow your heart. Follow what, what you think feels right. It's difficult to make that also fit with making a living and doing what society says is the appropriate thing to do. to be a little inappropriate. It's okay. <laughs> and then have fun, you know? Just enjoy. Because if you don't enjoy it, it, it'll, it won't turn out the way you want it to. Accept the fact that it's going to be tough sometimes, but stick with it. It's worth it.